The ARC utility is utilized for four reasons. It stands for Archive Recovery Console. Those four reasons are Archive, which will back up information from a Teradata system into some type of portable storage media, usually tape, but sometimes disk. Restore. The restore function reverses the archive process and moves the data from the storage media back to the database. Copy allows you to copy data from one system to another. Recovery utilizes information stored in permanent journals to roll back or roll forward row information. Reasons you might utilize ARC. Archive a database, individual table, or selected partitions of a PPI table directly from Teradata to external media such as tape or disk. Restore a database, individual table, or selected partitions of a PPI table back to Teradata from external media. Copy an archive database, table, or selected partitions of a PPI table to Teradata on a different Teradata system than one from which the system was archived. Place checkpoint entries in a Teradata journal table. Recover a database to checkpoint in time by using a roll back or roll forward using the before or after images from a permanent journal table. Delete rows from a journal table. The ARC utility has come a long way and above are some of the creative ideas that you might utilize to use ARC. ARC, raising the bar, backup, archive, restore. The ARC facility is required to archive, restore, copy the Teradata database and can be run in batch or can be run interactively. But Teradata uses third-party products in what they term BAR, backup, archive, restore. The third-party BAR products include Net Backup, Tivoli Storage Manager, Net Fault, Command Line, Arc Main, Execution. Arc commands in alphabetical order analyze, archive, build, checkpoint, copy, delete database, delete journal, log on, log off, restore, revalidate references, roll back, roll forward.